a Dread Fun original production. Please sit back and enjoy. Hey guys, Dread Fun here with another one of my time lapse video uploads. Uh, every now and again, I get a bee in my bonnet and have to do an impossibly difficult art assignment. Uh, one that I've been setting about doing, uh, or a couple that I want to do, are similar to my Batman, where I've done all the ple people that play the Batman character over the years. I've done it in a, an ink wash type comic book image style. So I really want to do a Superman, but also my wife wanted me to do Doctor Who, and this is the one that I'm doing. So I'm not a huge Doctor Who fan. I know a few, and uh, so I had to set about finding out who the 13 Doctors were. Uh, we have William Hartnell, Patrick Troughton, John uh, Pertwee, Tom Baker, Peter Davison, sorry, i got it written down over here, uh, Colin Baker, Sylvester McCoy, Paul McGann, Christopher Eccleston, who I actually like. I watched uh, his entire run as uh, Doctor Who. Uh, we also have David Tennant, Matt Smith, Peter Capaldi, and the person that's uh, getting a lot of people's uh, feathers in a ruffle, Jodie Whittaker. Apparently, some folks don't like that we have a female Doctor Who. Uh, personally, I'm not being attached to this and having no, uh, what do you call that, dog in the race? Or pony in the pool? I don't know. Um, I, I, I think it's great. Um, I've already, uh, you know, had this discussion with many folks and uh, people are on either side of the fence. So, I said about doing this, laying it all out, having each Doctor sort of in a roundabout scene with uh, Jody, the 13th Doctor, in the center, and then having uh, the TARDIS sort of uh, above her. Doing this, again, uh, I originally was thinking I was just going to do it in black and white, kind of like the Batman, but then I did, you know, thought I, I'd do it with my Doc Martin inks and, and add the color. Once I had them all laid out, I remember I'm filming this, trying to keep track of each doctor and making sure that they all look like the doctor that they're intended to and also keeping the color palette similar and this is actually if I remember one of the first times I actually filmed myself using the Doc Martin inks so uh, I was doubly anxious but in the end the entire picture came together and really looks good um, I've already been, had it displayed at Comic Cons and folks have uh, it's been a great discussion piece a lot of people have uh, purchased it uh, somebody that's a big fan of my art also purchased the original so I mean that, that's awesome I mean the original person that was going to buy it didn't want to buy it because it had to do with a female Doctor Who and like I said they don't like that ah, anyways so I'm very proud of this again it's really hard when you're doing these realistic uh, comic book images and trying to make them look like the real people because uh, I'm following to the comic book rules, but again, I'm using real images as my basis. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Dreadfun out. This has been a Dreadfun.com production. Thanks for watching.